Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Janet and today's video is going to, what is it? Um, it's going to finish, what is it? It's going to finish up the video, um, not the video. it's going to finish up the, yes? May I help you? It's going to finish up, like I was saying, the lip series that I've been doing and today is uh, going to, so today I'm going to show you my top five, I guess I'm not, <laughs> my top five burgundy lips. I'm trying to film with him right beside me because he wants something and I don't know what he wants. I tried giving him some a little snack but he doesn't want to, he just wants cuddles and loves. You should want cuddles? Come on, let me just do this real quick, okay? Um... And not only burgundies, but there's one little special mention. I want to welcome all my new subscribers. Thank you for subscribing to me. And I hope you are enjoying the videos that I am making for your enjoyment. And just let me know if you have any ideas or anything that I you've seen from my channel. Any products that you want me to feature or any ideas that you want me to do. I will be more than happy to make them. Um, so yeah, thank you for subscribing and if you are stopping by and watching this video and you haven't subscribed already, I hope you consider subscribing. Yes? Come on, come down. It's okay. Okay, we're gonna do this, okay? You wanna help with me? Okay, ready? Okay, so this one, we're gonna go with the first one. It's gonna be from NYX. Uh, it's from NYX and it's part of their liquid suede line. And this is one that i was use been using for years and years that I had to repurchase it because the other one I had had gone bad but I'm pretty sure I used a really good portion of it because that was like my go-to for the longest time before I even started um, buying high-end lipsticks oh, he's settled now. so it's called vintage if I didn't say and let's see this is going to be more of a now I wouldn't say black cherry but definitely that burgundy red color just really vampy vampy color right there very pretty it is one of those more drying liquid lipstick formulas but I don't mind I really like this formula and I also don't mind them to be so drying especially you can just put a little bit of lip balm and just kind of blot it on your lips before you put this on there oh, and I prefer liquid lipsticks when it comes to my darker colors and that's pretty much all I have is liquid lipsticks for this category just because again I just need something to stay put and I do have other ones that, um, oh my gosh, I did have other not liquid lipsticks, like I had regular lips, like matte lipsticks, like ColourPop, their lippy sticks and other things like that. But, however, but, um, but they were all discontinued. So again, when I'm showing you things and I'm recommending things, I want things that are not discontinued. Moving on to numero dos. Okay, this one's going to be from Dose of Colors, and you guys know the Dose of Colors are the mo one of the most comfortable liquid lipstick formulas if you are not into very drying formulas. And this is one that I'm going to have to replace pretty soon. It's drying up. So the next time they have a sale, probably by the end of this year, I will, re I will replace it because this is probably the last year that I use this particular shade. And the shade is Mood. And... Like, it still smells fine, which is why I haven't, like, used, I haven't thrown it away or anything. But I have used quite a bit of it. Of course, not finished it, but I have used quite a bit of it. And even seeing it next to it, like, next to the next one, this one is a lot more creamy, a lot, a little bit more moussey. And, um, just I think this formula in general is a little bit more moussey, and I think it's, it's changed a little bit, but not to where it smells bad or anything that I need to like, oh, I need to, it's, it needs to be gone from my collection. But again, it's still in that same color family right there. You could almost be dupes for each other, to be honest, which is probably why I love that color so much. But I, if you were to choose between these two, I'd choose the Dulce Colors because it is more comfortable. Um, moving on to the next one. It's going to be from Ofra, and this one is the shade Havana Nights. And this is still on their website. It was a collab between um, Kathleen Lights and Ofra, obviously. Um, and this is definitely more t turning towards your cherry red. And I say cherry because I have some cherries right in front of me so we can compare the colors. <laughs> and it's right there. 
that color right there so this is definitely going to be when it dries down a little bit more of that not black cherry but definitely leaning towards that going towards that that particular color family i love black cherry lipsticks mm. which is going into the next one that i have is actually a black cherry that mm, deliciousness that i love i swatched this the other day when i did the declutter for this which will go up after this video Ooh, it just it just gave me all the feels and the vibes of fall and i cannot wait for fall and winter again even even though you know it could be a little bit more dangerous with everything that's going on but this is the reality that we have to cope with now and we have to live in so yes so anyways moving on i made sure that this was on the website and available for you to purchase um and it's the shade sauvage and this was the first collab with desi and katie with dose of colors and it had been discontinued. I even bought a backup of it. And if I knew they were going to leave it on there, I wouldn't have bought a backup of it. But you never know if they're going to discontinue it. So hopefully it still works by the time I'm done with this. But this is honestly so perfect when I mean a black cherry vampy, vampy, vampy color. I mean, this is the epitome. Yes, baby, I'm almost done. Yeah, this is the epitome of that. Look at that. Aren't they pretty? So, right here, look at that. Oh, I love that. Mm -hmm. I just love it. It's so beautiful to me. Like, this is what I used to love where before I even really got into watching just YouTube, period. This, the more, I had so many of this color, like these colors right here. I had more of these colors than I actually had nudes <laughs> when I was watching, when I first started with just getting back into makeup and stuff. This is what I had. Next one is a shade from um, Urban Decay. And this is the shade called Blackmail. And it's in the matte formula. Hold on, baby. And so this shade, after Kat Von D discontinued that cathedral shade, I think, from the, her original formula of lip, of lip, of bullet lipsticks. Not liquid lipstick. Bullet lipsticks. I went looking for that shade. Now, that bullet lip, lipstick from K, um, Kat Von D was a terrible, terrible, terrible formula. But the color was so pretty. So I went on the search for it. And this is starting to turn. I can, no, oh, it smells the same. Um, This is the color that I found. Baby, I'm going, I'm going. And again, this is really black, black cherry. And if it is starting to turn, I just repurchase it, honestly, because I love this color so much. I just wish it was a little bit more matte there. But I put a lip, um, a lip liner and it's good to go. You see how that little gradient? I'm, I'm telling you, I love some dry lipsticks. It's that really, you can really see that black cherry right there. Look at that. Okay. Now the last one is a part of this mention. That's why I said six because I think this is one of the most special colors that I have in my entire collection. And actually, um, the Ofer just came out with one. So if you prefer the Ofer, um, the Ofer form. Uh, so, okay. So Ofer just came out with a color similar to this. And it's a collab with Jen Loves Reviews. So if you love her, go support her and go purchase that. But this is, especially if you love that Ofer formula more than the Dose of Colors. The shade here for the Dose of Color one is waste, um, Chocolate Wasted from that movie. Grown ups. Wasted. I'm gonna get totally wasted. I'm gonna get wasted every single day of my life. I wanna get chocolate wasted. Um, and then this is what it looks like right here. Ofer does have some browns actually. I was looking on their website the other day, and honestly, I kinda wanna try some of their browns that they have. And that's what that looks like right there. Oh, it is so beautiful on the lips. It literally looks like to scrum this chocolate you just want to eat and it's so beautiful again these are mostly colors that i do wear for fall but i just if you really like vampy lip colors these would definitely be my recommendations and my recommendation is just a rather lipstick a uh, liquid lipstick just because again you know that you, it will not move um and you won't feel like oh my gosh is it on my teeth is it around my lips and even if you just want to really set and lock that liquid lipstick in use a lip liner and you'll be set to go it'll be you'll be you're set to go set to go go to set set to go 
yeah look at that oh gives me all the chills so yeah if you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a like and a go follow me i just created finally created an instagram for my youtube and it's peacock underscore beauty i'll have it linked down below in the description box and i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope you have a great wonderful rest of your day thank you for watching i'll see you guys on the next one bye, -bye.